King Charles of Britannia was dead. Well, hello again, and welcome to everybody who has been asking me to do some more videos about Castles 2, Siege and Conquest. Um, first of all, let me apologize for my crappy mic. Um, I recorded those old videos with a completely bare-bones piece of junk laptop. Uh, I now have a much better rig. Well, better for, for me, anyway. I've never really been able to afford too much in the way of uh, high-end computers. Um, however, I am still using the same uh, tor terrible mic, so sorry. Um, but yes, anyway, to all the people who commented over the years on those uh, three videos I did for Castle Siege and Conquest, um, thank you. I never expected any, but I'm not sure how people were finding those. Um, but uh, yeah, I was very pleased with all the people who still today comment on them and ask me questions about the game. Um, and I try to help where I can. Um, four years ago, I was doing, um, I wasn't doing a whole lot, uh, really, except, um, constantly having to hold my baby daughter, who I just could not put down, or she'd wake up and start crying, so I just started playing Castles 2 Siege and Conquest on my laptop. Uh, why that game? I don't really know, but I played it so much, I started to get really good at it. So I made a few videos of myself speedrunning it. Um, and yeah, that's really all there is to it. I played this game when I was a kid. Um, I played it on the Mac, where it was just Castles, Siege and Conquest, because there was no Castles 1 on the Mac, apparently. But yeah, um, so today I think I'm just going to, um, jump right in, and we'll see how things go. I'm going to play as, oh yes, and I apologize in advance um, for slaughtering all the French pronunciations. Deal with it, I'm sorry, <laughs> I don't speak French. Um, I'm going to play as Albion on Impossible Difficulty, plots will be off. I'm going to keep the music off, sorry if you're going to miss out on those banging tunes, but uh, I'm sure you can find them somewhere on uh, YouTube. Uh, I'm going to turn speech off, that's, I'm ne well, I'll get into that later. Um, commodities will be balanced, and battles will be on, and I'm just going to jump right in here. So the first thing I'm going to do, I'm going to scout this territory, and I'm not going to put more than any more points to it than I need to. I'm going to gather, no, I'm going to add on some more military, and I'm going to put all of my remaining points into harvesting whatever resource I started with that appears to be iron. Um, I just realized there's a... It's probably not in the video, but uh, there's a big bar here. I'm assuming this isn't in the video. How do I move that thing? I don't... I don't want that bar. Uh, okay, well, how, where am I going to stick this? I guess down there. Alright, anyway, sorry about that. Uh, some... I, I, this is also my first time uh, streaming... Well, not streaming, I'm not streaming. Recording. Uh, with this rig, so uh, I'm getting used to some things, like having um, bars in the middle. Anyway, uh, okay, that's trees. Not interested in that too much. I will be eventually. Uh, gonna keep churning out my resources. Uh, gold, right, gold. Um, I don't want to go for that. Because one, two, three... Or maybe five, yes, five territories will be threatening that. Hmm, I think I'll let it go for now, because there will almost certainly be a piece of gold over there, so I will just let it go, however tempting it may be. I'm going to train some more archers, keep churning out the iron. Um, yeah, okay, I'm going to have to attack. I'll attack. No, I'll check the territory. Um... As I probably mentioned in one of my previous videos, I'm probably going to repeat myself a lot, um, the way your resources work, or the way your resource gathering, no, actually, no, it's not just that, the way everything works in the game is, you've got these, um, there's three types of actions you can do, administrative, military, and diplomatic, um, and the more you 
do things, the more, the higher these numbers will go. Um, however, only doing certain things will contribute to that. Um, scouting is not one of them, which is why I only put the bare minimum points into scouting. Um, you will get more bang for your buck, in my experience. Oh, okay, here's the Pope asking for money. He wants four gold, and I only have four gold. I'm not going to take that opportunity at this moment. Um, anyway, you get more bang for your buck uh, churning out your uh, resources over and over constantly. Um, because I'm getting administrative points by constantly gathering. However, I get half as much for whatever diplomatic and military points I put into it. And even though it's only half as much, I'll still gain more experience faster by putting my points into that and constantly gathering um, than I will, for example, constantly training archers, because eventually I'm going to not be able to train any more archers, because I don't want my army to get too big too quickly. Anyway, we're going to attack Normandy. And, yep, it's the same crappy uh, UI. Um, no way around it. Best strategy I have always found is just to focus fire on a unit. And he goes down. Focus fire on him. I'm using keyboard keys here to make the thing slightly more uh, bearable. Oh, no, nope, they're going the wrong way. What are you doing? Ah, stop it. No! Focus fire on him, I guess. Yeah, that could have gone better. Could have gone worse too, though. Um, but yeah, anyway, focus fire. Um, kill stuff as quick as you can. I don't. Actually, no, I should scout that. I guess that could potentially be the Pope. I don't think the Pope could be there. I don't know. Well, yeah, whatever. This lived dangerously. And yeah, anyway, so, uh, oh yeah, we have a new resource to, to gather now. Put everything I can into gather and just keep doing that over and over. I will get more points, more of these points faster doing it that way. I don't think attack grants you any experience, any of that type of experience. So, I forgot what that terrain does. So I think I'm going to put him down here. I'm just gonna... And begin. Focus fire on the archer. Focus fire on the infantry. Oh, nope. And look, he's already dead. And he's already dead. And what are you doing? Don't split up. And dead. I lost two guys, that means one unit is now deceased. And yep, it was a gold territory. <clears throat> and the problem with that being a gold territory means, well, one way or the other I'm going to want to put a castle there quickly. Uh, doesn't matter, nobody is ever going to attack this place, so you know what, I'm not even going to put any thought into this. I'm going to load my cheapest layout that will get me the bonus to harvesting. And what don't I have enough? Oh, I don't have enough resources for that. Okay. So, still don't have Why? Do I need to have six minimum? It's been a while. Some of the some things I've forgotten. No, I don't have enough trees. Okay. Oh, I don't have enough. Oh, that's bad. I have to go to the black market for this. I will trade three iron for one timber. Did that work? Oh, it worked. Okay, great. Build a castle. Now I'm going to put the minimum amount of points into castle building because no matter what, in my experience, um, it doesn't really matter. Uh, every extra point is one less day of build time. Um, and I'd rather have those points freed up for doing things like harvesting, which will get me experience in these categories. Uh, require two food, yes. Eat up. And oh yeah, I'm gonna attack this place. because It's next on the list. What am I not, what am I doing? I'm not gathering anything. 
next points. Uh, I've got some administrative. I got some diplomatic points. <sighs> uh, no, no. Why would I do that? I don't have any. I don't have any gold to offer him. I guess I'm just gonna sit on those two diplomatic points. That's a shame. Oh, I guess I could scout. Ready to attack the local lord. I'm not even going to attempt to say some of these names in French. Thank you for pointing out over the years how poor my pronunciation is. Oh, and no, I'm not planning to make this into any sort of speedrun. I think I'm just going to, you know, keep it simple for now. Where do you think you're going? Boom, boom, boom. Dead. Okay, so now I've got my four territories. Unfortunately, this one isn't protected by a castle, which means it could revolt, and as you can see, revolt is likely. That means I either got to build a castle there as soon as possible, or possibly go ahead and attack that and build the castle there. <sighs> Decisions. Okay, that's... yeah. Okay. He'll be after that gold spot. He probably has already taken that gold spot. Uh, iron is a fine resource. Yep, okay. Iron is a fine resource to put a castle on. I might just do that. Keep it simple. I'm playing on the highest difficulty setting. I don't think I'm going to overstretch myself, and it's been a long time. I used to have some of the aspects of this game down, just to where I didn't even have to think of it. Oh, wait, that's the Pope. Yeah, the colors are different in this game. That's the Pope. I don't have to worry about him. Um, hmm. I'm half tempted to take that and then give it to the Pope, too. Do I really want to get into a fight with Valois? Valois? This quick? Hey! Valois. Or Valois, as I always called it when I was a kid, because, you know, I didn't know better. Uh, ooh, I should probably be punished when I get the treatment. Um, make gold, recruit, yep, uh, okay, well, you know, if I'm super nice, maybe he'll build a castle there for me. Um, so yeah, this is, I'm playing this on Steam, um, uh, this isn't, I've never, I had no idea this game was even on Steam, I thought I was just gonna have to, um, acquire an old DOS copy of it. Um, but you know what? I didn't mind paying for this again. I've probably bought this game. I think this is my fourth time paying for it. Um, but you know, I'm, I'm quite fond of this. I don't mind, uh, don't know who owns the rights. Actually, no, I, I think it's still owned by the same people because, uh, I think they're still in business. Making, uh, military sort of simulation. Uh-oh. Uh, oh, they've it. Okay. That's not surprising. I knew that was coming. Pay my troops? Yes, I will pay my troops. And I'm going to go ahead and attack that. Uh, I think I'm going to put some points into that. because. Uh... Hey, the dog's after my microphone. Maybe I should let her have it. Anyway, I need to attack that. My castle in Brittany is now complete. Thank goodness for that. Um... Get this extra food. I'll be able to get some knights going soon. Maybe. Uh, yep. Ruin. Oh, no, I said I wasn't going to do that. I said I wasn't going to pronounce, do the names. Begin, AI, focus fire. Somebody asked me in one of the comments, they said, how do I make it? Oh, probably. I'll wait till the next battle and answer that question. Um, you may notice I have twice as many units on the map as I do represented up here. That's because um, the game has gone ahead and doubled. Um, they've made it so that the opponents have twice as many units and I have twice as many units. Um, and sometimes it goes up to four or eight and somebody asked what makes it do that. I don't know what makes it do that. I think the game just picks whatever's interesting Whatever it thinks will be interesting. I, I don't have a sorry, I don't have a better answer for it than that. 
Um, anyway, I have my thing back. What do I need? I need more trees again. Okay, not so bad. So, let's gather some trees. Some timber, perhaps. Or, should I just invest all my points into gold? And I'll need three trees. Probably don't want to do that in the black market. I think I'll just gather. Yeah, do that. Gold. Army. That coming. Keep an eye on this territory. See if he's building a castle for me. Aw. Uh, three gold from the law. I will be probably fighting with him soon. I think I'm not going to bother to pay him off. To buy him off. I think it's probably the better term. Oh, why am I only playing one? Oh, well, I was probably more focused on the trees. That's why. But always want to put at least two points into gold. Or, rather, um... I can get two gold. I can harvest gold for two here because of the castle. The castle doubles whatever I can mine from there. Um, but only if I'm putting at least two administrative points in. So, oh, why do I have three trees? Oh, no. Why do I have three trees? I must have just done it three times in my notice. Okay, anyway. Build a castle. Hmm. attack the law. Perhaps not yet. No, I can't. Uh, oh, three gold, you piece of... <sighs> How about happiness? Can I make ha No. No, of course I can't do happiness. I need trees to make people happy. Insert hippie reference here. Oops. Uh, hope. Hmm. Damn. Didn't want to pay him for it. Wanted to pay him some money, but I didn't want to pay him for it. Oh, wah. Too big for his britches there. So, I think I'm gonna go ahead and attack him. No, let's do happiness. The dog's freaking out at the cats in the background. That's tough for her. Uh, I'm sorry if that's probably really annoying. Okay, I'll sign a future. Why not? Um, he's really desperate to be friends with me. Should I be suspicious? Does he know I'm building up one army? Oh! This game over already? I'm gonna start losing troops fast. Nope, and there they go. That's three troops I've lost because I didn't have enough food to feed them. Okay, well, two food, okay. I can do two. Seems I'm not gonna notice for three gold. I don't have three gold. Isn't in the mood to negotiate. 
I better save up some gold. And uh, rehire my archers. No, I can't. Ah, uh, really got messed over on this uh, gold tile placement. Because if you really, if you have a, any of these three are gold, you can put it. Well, maybe not any of these things. Any of these two are gold. You can put a castle there, and everything will be protected from revolt. But if the gold tile is here or here, you got to build two castles, or just ignore this tile completely and take over one of these. And. Done. Okay. Castle is complete. Okay. I do not have to worry about any more of my territories revolting. Army. Uh, I, oh, okay. still, still don't have any timber or iron. Uh, Law is here. Uh, yeah, alright. Ah, good, thanks. Why not? Start doing nights. Oh, this is three gold. I'll do two gold. Oh, I have to watch out though. Getting close to payday. Uh, at least I'm not losing the night. Stand on the Pope's good side. You need to stay on the Pope's good side, because I will eventually be attacking my neighbors, and the Pope gets annoyed when you attack your neighbors. Pope wants money. Uh, no, I don't have that. The Pope gets annoyed when you attack neighbors that he likes, but when you're playing on Impossible, he likes everyone, so, you know. Um... Out the gold if I do that. All right, let's see. Let's let's uh, let's see how Valois is doing. I'm gonna put extra points into this, these actions because I have a higher chance of succeeding. Hello, he wants two gold. Hmm, he's up. Uh, three gold. Yeah, fine. My gold. He has seven territories, twelve units. I can take him. Take him just for ooh. He never built a castle there. I'm just I'm also surprised he managed to hang on to it as long as he did. Hmm. Andrew will take that. And I'm tempted to let him have it. I think I'll just go straight into that territory. I don't have any food. More gold. More food. Seven. Hmm. Yeah, just gonna have to let it go. everything into that just so I can keep getting some more experience points. Okay. 
Uh, yes, here we go. Here's what I was saying. The scale is one to one. That means every unit that dies, I will be out that unit. Um, not too worried about that, though, because he's only got one knight and one infantry. Uh, again, and I will focus fire on that knight, because everyone's going to get to him first. Boom, boom. Take it. And there they go. And you can't stop your units from attacking the fleeing guys, which means sometimes you can lose forces after the battle. Okay. Oh yes. And this is this 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 makes me mad. This version of the game, I'm not sure. I've never played this version with the speech enabled and all that. But for whatever reason, in this version of the game, when you make the Pope mad, the game doesn't tell you. You have to come to the screen here and check your relationship with the Pope. Um, in every other version of this game, and I've played the DOS version, a previous DOS version, I would say, and the Mac version, the game always has a special screen pop-up that says, you have angered the Pope, but in this version, you gotta keep your eye on this number, because if this goes to two, you're excommunicated, and that is, generally speaking, bad news. Anyway, uh, I've seen that this guy has nothing to threaten me with. I'm going for that gold castle. And yes, I did just put everything into that attack because I'm not giving him a chance to build up his forces. <laughs> oh, I feel so bad for this guy. Um, I'd be tempted just to send my archers in. matters. I'm going to put my knights over here, I'm gonna begin the game, and I'm going to tell my infantrymen to hold. And I don't really care what the archers do. There's the lone infantryman. Man. Oh, what are you doing, piece of shit? Richard, you. Really? Nah, I suppose there's isn't something coming. In? Oh yeah, the archers killed the uh, guy. Hmm. And I lost two archers. Oh, but I have a nice... Okay, so, I got two gold producing territories with castles built on them. That means I have money for days. However, the Pope is now at four. I gotta be very careful what I do from here on out. So I'm going to get that gold, and I'm going to send a diplomat to the Pope, and I'm going to put in... Hmm, I'll just leave it there. You keep producing gold, and I'm going to attack this food turn. Yes. And the diplomat came back. Okay. My relationship is back to six. That's good. Gold's coming in. I'm not sure if I'm going to get this food gathered in time. Ugh. 
Ouch. God damn it. Ugh. Sometimes you just get screwed over. With the timings on this stuff. Anyway. Two food? Yes, I will. I will give them that. Anyway. Burgundy? Oh, no. When did that happen? I thought Angie was going to come up. I guess it could have been Burgundy just as much. Alright, well, in that case, I'm going to attack them. Him there. And I'm going to try to some knights. I'm going to keep that one food. I'm going to keep that one gold. And I'm going to scout. Can't make more knights. Now I can. Uh, okay. Let's go with that to territory. Basically, Val Valois is on his last legs. Uh, ooh. Oh. Okay. He obviously had time to rebuild, even though Burgundy was also attacking him. Uh, but whatever. It is what it is. Okay. I, hmm. Now I know I can win this fight, but I think I'm going to try to draw out their knights as far as I can from the rest of the forces. So I'm going to move them to the back of the battlefield, I'm going to begin, I'm going to immediately send them running back that way. To that spot, if I can. Alright, that's far enough. Get a little line of knights here. Hopefully, they will. Well, my infantrymen are absorbing most of that. Alright, focus fire on whoever. Going, you, you want to avoid this sort of free-for-all setup as best you can. Oh, it's man. That's not over. Uh, oh. Oops. Back at that. Aggro and everybody else. Okay, well, that's fine. That's another night dead. There's two five. Uh -huh, yep, as I predicted. Burgundy has caught up. That's Burgundy and that is Probably Burgundy too. I mean, I should probably start making friends with Burgundy. Two gold. Yes, I I will pay them. That. Thank you very much. And I don't have any trees. Timber. Right. Oh, uh, I'm not going to haggle. I'll just take it. Hmm. Let's see how Burgundy is. I'm just going to put all my points into that one for luck. Um... Didn't work. That's fine. I'm not going to try that again. I will, however, send a diplomat to Burgundy. I'm also going to put extra points into that to increase the likelihood of that succeeding. Um, and I'm going to. More 
timber cut. More food harvesting. Oh, well. Let's do that again. Cheap friends. Um, do I have enough timber? I think I do. Alright. Do some iron. I'm sitting in a very good position here because I have only one person. Burgundy's here. I have a mountain of. Not a mountain of gold, but I have quite a bit of gold and only one person I need to pay off to prevent from attacking. That won't keep him away forever, but it will. Make a deal. I'll just keep some of the plants over there, then. Um, and then... That, and... Okay. Three gold. Eight. Let's go ahead and cancel that. Uh, happiness. Let's work on our happiness. Food. Alright. And let's get an army going. I've got quite a bit of food now. Not as much as I'd like, but you know, quite a bit. Uh, three food, yep, Got enough. Where's the Pope? He should be here right about now. Begging me for money. Archers. Never have too many archers. Hmm. Let's try something in this. Just in case Andrews come up and started taking over Burgundy's territory. All right. Okay. Probably no. Probably policing his realm. Oh, here we go. Sixteen, sixteen units strong, and their happiness. Alone. Well, so shall I. So, eight. Okay, I can probably take him on head-to-head. -head. My relationship with the Pope isn't as good as I'd like for it to be, so I have to take that into consideration. Hmm. What iron territories do I have? Three more knights. Minus nine, dip that. Probably should put more points into a diplomatic request, but whatever. Uh, five gold. Okay, so we need five food. Could probably save that up in the next six months. Ooh, that was a cheap, was a cheap little bit, a uh, little donation I made to the Pope there. 
think it's time to rock and roll. Probably didn't need to put all those points into it, but... Uh -oh. I'm a bit superstitious. Attack Bergen. Right, let's do this. Hmm. Alright, I'm gonna move him to the top left corner. I'm gonna retreat a bit. Try to draw them out into another little line as best as I can. through their artillery. Ah, there they go. And I wish they wouldn't run after them, because I can't afford to lose any more troops, but... Well, that's how the game works. Oh, looks like I didn't lose anyone. Hooray! Ah! Eat that. And the Pope wasn't happy with that, but that's just too bad. Right. Burgundy's obviously in there too. I might want to consider policing my realm. But maybe not yet. So let's... Let's do as much damage to Burgundy as we can before he retaliates. Uh, keep that food and gold coming. Uh, I don't know what I'm going to do. Just keep sending the comments to the Pope. Oh! Well. That's nice. Apparently they rebelled. Not that. I guess that's one less point uh, I need to worry about with the Pope. You dead. Okay. Alright, all this stuff is protected. All of my stuff is protected. That is almost certainly a Pope territory. I guess I might as well just confirm that. Hmm. Do I want to attack a castle? I have to think about this. Not that I'm not... I'm completely convinced that I could protect that castle, but it's just... Castle battles are such a pain in the ass sometimes. I'm not sure if I really want to put myself in that position. I, I'm actually not too close to... Claiming. Not too far from claiming. I could just sit on what I've got. Maybe I'll just do that. Just sit on what I've got and call it good. And... Police realm. Got my six food. I think that's reasonable. Six food. Uh, this is Burgundy. Oh, he's not as mad about that whole thing as I thought. Maybe I will just go ahead and bow him off. How? Come on! I sent him a perfectly reasonable bribe. There. Okay. matter about that. Oh, come on, Popey. Ugh. Just leave it there, I guess. Alright, then I think for the rest of the game, I'm just going to churn out... I was going to turn out gold, but I need some trees fast, so that I can get my happiness back to 9. That done quick. And I'm going to turn out gold after gold, and we're going to just claim as soon as we can. It's 
six food. I can feed them six food. Uh, Burgundy wants money. Uh, okay. I think I can afford it now. Change of plans. Right. Nice castle territories you've got there. Be a shame if something were to happen to them. Castle territories obviously offering you the most points. I'm ready to attack Burgundy. Yeah, you're not my friend anymore, Burgundy. Sorry. Oh, you know, if I had been thinking, I would have attacked non-castle territory first to weaken his forces. Oh well, I'm sure my knights will have no problem getting the job done. Right, archers, you guys just stand there. Uh, stand this Knights, do your business. Oh, we go. Keep them together as one unit. Right. Ugh. Stop it! How you gotta be that guy? Now, they're stuck. It's not necessarily a bad thing. The thing is, I gotta keep moving, or else time will run out and I will lose this fight. There we go. I hope oh, I lost two knights. Okay. Um, right. Like I just said, I'm going to attack this turn. To, well, obviously, the fact that I have to stop Burgundy from claiming now means I won't be claiming myself anytime soon. I need to protect Burgundy. Send them up there. Usual strategy. Of making them draw themselves into a line. Blam, blam, blam. There we go. And there they go. There, die, 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 die. Okay, I don't think I lost anybody doing that. Uh, House of Revolution for the Pope. Still pretty good. Attack that castle territory. Maybe. As much as I want more gold, maybe I should do this one instead. Not to back Burgundy. Oh, good. That means I don't have to attack him. Although the damage is already done, I might as well just finish what I've started. Attack Burgundy. Another castle I have to deal with. Since I'll have all my knights. Attack 
infantry will stand. Send my archers after one specific guy. Oh, just the two archers? That was a good idea. Ugh, manually steer the knights around the keep, because the game is just a shitty, U a terrible UI. I can't figure out how to get to that other knight. No! Yes, there you go. I'm gonna send my archers running away. Oh, I say we won. Mm-hmm. Burgundy! Actually grew a pair. Alright, let's see here. Um, any terrain I can use to slow them down? Not really. I suppose I could set the battle here. That's not really doing any good. I'm gonna put everybody up here. Again, you guys go that way. Oh, they ran away. Huh. That's funny. My happiness is still not. <sighs> I think I'm gonna have to place my realm. Uh, ready to attack Burgundy? Yes. Okay. Fight, we just gotta let them break the doors down and kill the guys. Kill the guy. I think if they kill that infantryman, this will be immediately over. And um, okay. Yeah, now the infantryman decides to wake up. Go on, and he's dead. Claim now, but I'm not gonna. Actually, I might do. Hmm. And you could attack me. Now. He already hates me. If he attacks, what did they? Who wants that? Yes! Take my money, please! And it's still up. I'd say it's time to attack Burgundy again, just to keep him from getting any aid. Ooh, the engine. Alright. Okay, well, I don't know what army he's packing, but I could guess, so. That's not so bad, actually. One, two, three, four. Okay, 
well, I don't think I'm gonna even bother fighting this battle. Where did he attack? I will be happy to return the favor. Can't get that. Uh, Andrew. Oh, you just attacked me. You scum sucker. Oh! I was going to do that. Alright, Burgundy. You dig it. Focus on the one knight. Boom. And they're dead. Right. Time to one two punch this. Uh, and you. I can't attack. I can't attack because I have no iron. One. But I do have timber. I had timber. Attack before he gets any bright ideas. Put everything I have into this one. Ah, ah yes. And we're gonna attack Andrew, and I'm gonna pay him back for what he did to me. Focus fire. And they're dead. Okay, so. I could carry on like this, but I also have to balance my relationship with the Pope. So. <sighs> Let's attack Burgundy. Well, might as well just go ahead and take this territory now. Because there's. I'm, I've already got both these guys on my case, so. There's no point in trying to shield myself. And we're going to take Burgundy. And after this, after these next two fights, I am not going to be able to do any more fighting uh, until I improve my uh, improve my my relationship with. The and give me some time to find the door. So I'm gonna have to. S when I say one two punch, that's my terminology for when um, you have two enemies in the game, and you you go back and forth attacking both sides before they have a chance to recover their armies. Um, it doesn't work so well when you've got three enemies. Uh, it's possible, uh, but it tends not to go well. So I just beat Burgundy, I'm going to immediately switch over to Anjou, and I think I'll keep my Diplomacy points free, so I can go beg the Pope's forgiveness for daring to attack his darlings, oops, that should have gone, should have put more points into it, not points, but uh, offer more money, oh, 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 Anjou, you beat me to the punch, okay. Too bad I, uh, you don't have much to threaten me with. Hmm, okay, we got a Ballista. And a Siege Tower. Siege Tower could be a problem. I think what I'm going to do is put all my knights out here and let them deal with that attack. My archers, they can stay where they are. The infantrymen, I'm going to keep on this side of the wall, and they're going to stand. They're really just going to be cannon fodder. Archers are going to stand. Knights are going to quickly... No, I think I'm just going to go straight for that. Okay. Begin. Oh, they've got a... Oh, they've got two things. 
And there we go. And there we go. Pause it. Unpause it. I think the AI already knows what to do. Ah. Um. What? Do other more forces? This is strange. Okay. Be a glitch. I'm pretty sure I've destroyed all of his forces. He must have some more forces out here somewhere that aren't doing anything. Oh, battle deadlock. Okay. See what I mean about um, sieges if they take too long? Uh, more importantly, I wrecked his forces. Who, who am I attacking again? Andrew. I think I need to police my room. It's not going to be an issue because I am repelling all the attacks that I'm being sent, and sometimes when you repel an attack, you get a nice little bonus to your happiness. Ooh. Oh, and I can't see that. I think it's saying saboteurs have been cut. Oh, Andrew thinks he can beat me. Hmm, let's see how this goes. Yeah. Yeah, that's what. And I suspect that's my happiness back to nine. Because I, yep, I will have just lost a point because I'm policing my realm. And I just got a point back. I think I'm just going to go ahead and claim. Right. Where's Yeah, I'd say I've got this in the bag. Not just this battle, but this whole campaign. Knights, do your thing. Uh, this guy stand. All I need to do is keep churning out gold, and my points will remain high enough that to stave off whatever happens. Oh yeah, I suppose I could get excommunicated. That would that would ruin my game. Oh. I just got excommunicated. Ouch! <laughs> See what I mean about not checking your um, your ratings? Okay, well, that's bad, but uh, it's workable. Mm -hmm. Catching more guys, catching more guys. Catching more guys. I'm assuming that's what that one is. Feed my troops. This is back out. Uh, yes, this is why I saved up money. How many enemies do I have? Right, anyway. Uh, oh. Um, I can't get excommunicated again. Mm 
might as well keep up the attacks. I don't know what's going on. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, that doesn't surprise me. That's really embarrassing. But, it happens. Where's another territory that is owned by him? He's attacking. Oh, see, you, in the perfect world, you will. Oh. In the perfect, in the perfect situation, see, the game makes a decision to attack you, but then it has to, you know, wait. It has to. Uh, it's got its own little bars going. Um, so I think what happens is it decides to attack you. Oh no. I'm gonna have to police my realm. It's gonna make my people angry. Police the realm. Get my happiness back up. I forgot to save a point for scout. Uh, here comes the Pope. Sure, why not? Hey! I was policing my realm! Who is sending all these people? Oh, wait a minute. Why am I losing... Why is my relationship with the Pope going down? I'm not doing it. There we go. Oh uh, no. Okay. I might be in for it here. Maybe not. Hmm. Four nights to two. But I've only got happiness three or four. I guess remember that. I think we need to retreat. Oh no, no, don't retreat that way. Okay, um, this could be worse. I definitely messed him up enough. I'm not.
Andrew is attacking us. Damn it, Andrew. He's going to stand there and wait. In fact, second thought, I think I'm just going to put him here. So all they're sending in from that side are archers. Alright, so, focus fire on him. Okay. Forces, my units aren't doing a very good job. Ugh. Might not have, might just not upload this. I'm doing so badly now. He's down, why don't you, Burgundy? <sighs> See, I was doing so well. Until I got excommunicated. Maybe I should get some more forces before I start attacking back. Food. Right. Not too much to micromanage here. I'm sure you're going to make me very proud of that. Ah, yes, I have all the money that the Pope wants. Yes. Oh, good. I'm no longer extreme. Four? Oh, my 
actually have enough food. Andrew. And I think I'm just going to seed that poke. And I'm going to burgundy again. Let me have a chance to figure out what the hell just happened. Why, yes, I do have some gold for you, Mr. Pope. Not the infantry units. Burgundy. Yeah, hey, I'm back. Remember me? Okay, what's going on over there? No. Get up there, and you go in from the other side. For some reason, that infantryman is just sat sitting up there. I don't know what he's waiting for. Right. Knights destroy door. Knights destroy the door. There we go. Maybe? Oh, there is no door. So he's just going to sit there and let time run. Ah, oh, so annoyed. Stupid entry. You go here. Gripping footage, I'm sure. I'm hoping I can move my knife to a, a place that will trigger Two gold. Hmm. Oh, I'm out of. Coming, okay, not surprised. It's wide open. Hmm. 
Okay, I think I can handle this. Again. That could have been better, but, you know, for a defensive battle, I'd say that was pretty good. Recruit more knights. Andrew. Andrew's attacking again? Okay. I can't imagine that's going to go well for him. Boom, 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 boom. Yeah, okay. Alright, time to swing back around and attack Burgundy. Burgundy. I don't think I'm gonna bother. Three gold. Burgundy. Oh no! This could be bad. How bad? Hmm. Nah, uh, same situation as before. Got I don't know what you think you're doing, but you better leave this for the big boys. Hey! Once again, there must be a phantom unit out there somewhere. Alright, well, there's no time run out. I'd really like to know how he saved up for one of those, th the, all these things. Battle deadlock, I win. Hmm. I might just hold off on attacking. In that case. And back to the original plan that I had half an hour ago. I'm just gonna crank out gold here. Should I police the realm? I think I should police the realm. Yes. I suspect neither of those two are happy with me. So we'll do that, I'll beef up my happiness, and why not? Gold for everyone. Army of Bur- you just asked me for gold, you scum sucker.
Let's not get cocky here. Where's that other? We'll have more forces out there somewhere. No, apparently not. Okay, then. Yeah, <laughs> that's about that. Alright, so that's Burgundy. Definitely isn't a threat right now. Anjou is another matter. And I'm quickly approaching the threshold for declaring... Burgundy. I should kill you. A little more. Andrew, yes, I will pay you off. Okay. <sighs> really? I mean, it's not a bad force, but... You're dead, you're dead, you're dead, you're dead, you're dead, you're dead. Okay then, I think I'm just gonna go ahead and declare. Yeah. You wanna be friends with me? Okay. Why not? Not my castle. Hey. Pope wants money. Pope can have money. I am policing my bloody realm. What do I pay you people for? <gasps> no. Feed our troops. Handle that. Burgundy. Ah, here it comes. Let's see what we're to them. Okay. Knights. Infantry. I don't have any archers. Huh. Forgot to tell them the folks fire. Oh well. And refining gold, and I win. Okay, October 17th, 1319. Playing time, 1 hour and 15 minutes. <laughs> Not a speed run by any stretch of the imagination. But, yeah, that was uh, my first time playing on Impossible in probably since I recorded those old videos. So, there you go. As you can see, I messed up. And when I was going for the win, I got excommunicated, and that cost me like half an hour of playing time. So don't do that. Uh, this game really, this version of the game could uh, make things a bit easier, but uh, it's not going to do that, is it? <sighs> well, yeah, here you go. Um, maybe I'll make another video. Um, as long as people are still reading and commenting on the old videos, I might as well keep making a few more of these. And hey, maybe I'll, uh, now that I actually have a rig that can play games, maybe I'll upload some other videos for some other games. I don't really know. I just wanted to make this for all the people who've asked me to make more over the years. Um, so, here you go. Hope you enjoyed it. I enjoyed playing, um, for the most part. Um, but yeah. Oh, what was my, uh, what was my rank? What did I say? October? Yeah, 1319. Yeah, of course, because I went on possible. I'm a prince. Well, I'll take it. Anyway, tune in next time.